uh, Spud from Survivor Southwest here. And today I'm just going to show you how you can get drinking water out of the ocean or out of a salt water body. Before I do that, if you do enjoy the content I'm putting out on my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button, give it a like, share my videos around. Let's get into it. Okay, so there are a few methods of desalinating salt water to be able to drink. I'm only going to run through one today, and that is a variant of the solar steel. What you're going to need is something to dig with, a plastic sheet, and a bit of cloth, whether it's a t-shirt, pants. Uh, I'm using my um, schmug. So what you want to do, first off, is dig yourself a hole. Alright, so now that I've got my hole dug, it's in full sun, which is very important. If it's in the shade, this isn't gonna work. This is just a variant of a solar still. Um, but you'll see what I'm gonna use that cloth for in a minute. There is another way of doing this, which I'll tell you a bit later. So now that I've got the hole dug, it's time to go uh, dip that cloth in the ocean, get as much water in it as I can. Okay, now I've got that cloth nice and wet. What I want to do is I want to put that in the hole and place what I'm collecting my water in in the middle. And as per usual with the solar steel, grab your plastic sheet. cover it over around the edges. cover it all the way around make sure that there's no gaps that any water vapor may escape and lastly get yourself a rock and place that directly over your cup. And as you can see, this plastic's only been on there for a minute or so, 
and already we got water vapor forming now what's going to happen is as that water evaporates out of the towel or out of the schmug or your shirt whatever you're using it's going to hit that plastic it's going to drip down to the lowest point and fall into your cup so that's why it's important to make sure that your rock is directly over what you're collecting water in and now all we have to do is wait so find yourself somewhere nice in the shade and wait now this isn't going to produce a lot of water but uh, it will produce water so if you've got enough resources to make multiple of these go for it collect as much water as you can and uh, so now we just come back a bit later and see how much water we got all right so it's been about an hour and a half close to two hours since I set up that solar still and what I've been doing is sitting over there in the shade which on a day like today is possibly one of the best things I can do in a survival situation uh, is to not ration my water but to ration how much I sweat so if I was working and doing physically demanding tasks during this part of the day I'd become dehydrated very quickly and no amount of water coming out of that still will help um, so yeah sitting in the shade during the middle of the day during the heat of the day is uh, is a very important part so I'm just heading down to where my still is and I have an empty cup so you can see how much water I got in a little under two hours while I was sitting in the shade doing absolutely nothing this still has been doing all the work for me and we'll see how much water we got all right okay so we see the still before we open it up I'm just gonna tap the plastic a bit get all these water drops that are forming around there the big ones get them to run down and go into the cup I can already see I've got water in there now obviously the longer I leave it, the uh, the more water it's going to collect, but uh, we'll open it up and see what we've got. It's very steamy in there. There we go. It's not much water and it's quite hot, but it's water. And that water is as fresh as anything. Well, there you have it guys, a simple way of being able to collect fresh water straight out of a salt water body like the ocean or this estuary. Once again guys, if you do like the content I'm putting out on my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos as I try to post at least once a week, um, including my shorts. And uh, be sure to give it a like and share my videos around, tell your friends, and I'll see you all next time.